Look at example number two now. Which expression below are equivalent? So just looking at them, can you tell me this one equals that one? That's what the word equivalent means, right? So which one of these are equal to each other? So before I even start doing that, I would want to distribute this one out. So I've got 4 times 2x minus 1. So I'm going to do 4 times 2x. That's 8x's. And then I'm going to do 4 times 1. I'm going to bring that minus sign down. 4 times 1 is 4. So now you can see that this is the same thing as this guy. So what we can say is this one is equal to this guy. Which one is not equal to them is the 4x. We can't take 8x's minus 4 and say that's 4x. And a lot of people want to do that. They, they say, I have 8. Well, what's 8 take away 4? Well, that's 4. It's, we can't combine these, okay? This one has an x. This one does not have an x. So they're not alike, and you can't just squish them together. Okay, so this is what's equivalent. This is not equivalent or not equal to.